Here at Dixie Escalandi, the construction crew is replacing an old power line. We are replacing old rickety poles with new taller, stouter poles and exchanging the small brittle copper wire with new steel core aluminum wire that is many times larger and stronger. This line upgrade will give new life to an old line and increase the load it can carry. In fact, we're rebuilding the old lines all the way from the crossroads at Burrow Junction to the substation at Austin so that in an emergency, either of the two substations can carry all the load from both. This project is fairly complicated because we want to minimize the disruption of service to our members. We don't want to turn off their power. That means before we take out a section of the old line, we have to bring power from another direction for the section so there are no power outages or we have to perform the work hot, which means we have to work around the energized conductors. Since each wire is energized to over 7200 volts, we have to be very careful. We use insulated equipment and tools to move the energized wires from the old poles and out of our workspace before we remove old poles and replace it with a new pole. Then we place rollers on the new, new structures. Rollers look like pulleys through which we pull non-conductive ropes. The ropes are used to pull in the new aluminum wires. When the new wires are brought up to the proper tension and insulated from the ground, we energize them and then move the loads over to the new wires. Finally, we use the rollers to pull out the old copper wires. The copper wire is sold to recyclers to help offset the cost of the new construction. We expect these new poles and wires to last at least 30 to 40 years and possibly longer.